Do I go on World of Darkness or do I go on the wiki? Either or, man. Either or. We can make it work. The viewers are going to know what's happening behind the scenes. I mean, I don't think anyone plays this chapter without looking at one of those two. Because oh, welcome course. back to Fire Emblem 6, The Binding Blade, a Fire Emblem 6 ROM hack by Intelligence Systems. And we're about to embark on... One of the one of my favorite chapters, also one of the most difficult, and also one that can make things go really badly if we're not careful. So, I'm excited. But since we have the legendary Panda behind the wheel, nothing could go wrong. With right. this with this music in the background, maybe not. But I'm Pandan, and I'm joined here by Zenith, and we're gonna hey, just hey. jump right back in. So, I think I was telling you, man, I did. I did more prep for this, like, than I probably do for, like, meetings at work. Like, this was, like, <laughs> this was, like, the most homework I've done for Fire Emblem in a while. Dude, you gotta prepare for this chat, because it's gonna throw everything at you. Yeah, I, um, I, like, played out, like, some scenarios. I tried, I didn't, like, actually, like, play ahead or, like, play anything with our units. I just, like, watched other people and how they approached it. Right. Um, because I felt like it's kind of... It ruins the the sanctity of the Iron Man run if we practice. That kind of defeats the purpose. Yeah, uh, I suppose so. I so. was just thinking to myself, right? There's sort of two massive hurdles in this chapter, and that's the wyverns and the cavaliers that come from behind. They are like the two. Because look at that. Yeah, they're, they're massive. Monstrous. They're absolutely massive. Uh, there's a lot of tough enemies on this map. They come at you all at once, and we have to play much more aggressively than I think anyone normal would play it because of mm. Zealot and Trek joining in, like, these two spots. Yeah, it's so, really tricky. So there are a couple different... So I'll, I'll walk you through, Zenith, what I've planned. Right, go now, for it. So first off, we're going to give Roy the Angelic Robe <laughs> because he's going to yeah, need the definitely. extra... He needs the extra HP, but I also gave him the hammer and Lot's hand axe. This is so that he can, when he talks to Jarrod, he can trade um, and get that over to him. Okay. So this way Jarrod can like wait in place and kill the armor knight in that spot. Um, and then also just have a hand axe ready to go. Right, uh, so I think Jarrod has, um, or Zelot or whatever, I think they, he has a D rank in axes. He does. So he can use the hammer, the halberd, all this good stuff. Um, I also, I'm gonna give Rutger the goddess icon, because his luck is four. Yeah, I'm not liking that, because the day he gets hit with a crit, I don't even know, man. Yeah, like, I debated back and forth between giving it to Rutger and giving it to Lot, but I'm like, Rutger, as much as I love Lot, Rutger is so much more essential. <laughs> yeah, it's just not, you don't even want to take the chance, really. Yeah, and then we gave Lot the killer axe. Yeah. Cause... Ooh! <gasps> I forgot we got that. Yeah, it's gonna spicy. be fun. It's gonna be spicy. And then it's kind of down. The halberd, doesn't he? he sells the halberd as well. Uh, good. And then good. down towards the bottom, I left Chad unequipped because one, he's probably not gonna fight anything, and two, if he does, it's probably bad news if I need him for anything. Like he's not yeah. gonna be able to do enough damage. Like he's hitting like for eight with the iron sword. Most of these guys have like seven defense or more, so he's gonna be virtually useless in combat here. His only real use is probably going to be running to the right and grabbing that killing edge. Yeah. Uh, and then going up to the top right to get the rapier and whatever else is in there. Yeah, there are chests up there. There's a stealable red gem. Um, a few stealable vulnerabilities we can snag if we're feeling so bold, which I don't think we will be. <laughs> Definitely not. Uh, but then we kind of get down here. And I wanted to bring Shanna and Sue. Mostly, and this is... Shanna and Sue, right. So okay. this is kind of the risky part of it is that... Neither of these two can die, because it can really screw up us getting, like, the ideal ending. Um, which is, like, something we don't want to happen, oh, but yeah, also... Uh, if we if we lose Shu, Sue, we lose Shin. Um, which would be... Right, that which... still means... If we go Ilya, but we, we, we're... Wait, oh no. That's a good point, actually. I think if we don't go to Sakai, then... Sh Not that we want to lose them, but I don't think it's... Do you see what I'm trying to say? Like, I think we still get Murglaze and... Anyway, I, even if Sue died. I think we do, um, but I really don't want to lose. I did, the most important thing to me is like making sure we get Shin. Um, right. Okay. But um, so but Shanna will be useful to fly across the houses. So. Exactly. Yeah. I I brought them predominant. Sue can take some. Sue can survive like a hit from 
a wyvern with the steel bow equipped and not get doubled, which is pretty tight. Um, and do like 11 right, damage good. back. And Shanna, uh, she's going to be mostly useful for ferrying people. And both of them can do that since we're going to like be visiting a ton of houses and just keep positioning a lot. Because the only way that we're going to successfully defeat this map is by doing a lot of rescue dropping. So... Okay. Well, if you, that's what you've got in mind, then I leave it. I leave you. I leave you to it. I, then think, I think that works for me. The, the other things I did. So I actually made a shopping list as well that I wrote down. Um, okay. Like I pro, I do. I swear I do more prep for this chapter. Like I go to the grocery store and I just wander the aisles aimlessly until I find like, oh, the sourdough bread looks nice. So like I'll eat that today. <laughs> and meanwhile, it's like here. It's like I need precisely two thunder tomes, two iron swords, two steel swords. Like I have it all. Okay. Yeah, steel swords down. are very valuable. Need that yeah, we could... and, and this is a pretty decent chapter for shopping, so we'll see what we get. Um, and then the other debate that I've had, and I'm curious to get your take on this because I know that I'm biased, mm -hmm. but I was thinking potentially of sending Lot, Deke, and Rutger to choke this side with Clarine. Not a bad idea. Because Lot Not can definitely. just because Lot can one round this guy with the, the oh he doesn't have the hammer anymore. Never mind. Um, you have can... to make sure that you keep Sue on, on reserve because um, the Wyvern will come down there quite quickly. And if you've pushed them too far up, then it's yeah. going to be really difficult to be able to swarm the Wyvern. So it'll just sit on top of a house or the, even worse, the Colosseum. Yeah, that, that's a good call. So, I mean, I'm probably like getting to this part is going to be most essential just to like help draw some fire over. Um, I watched the Dondon strat where he like has Marcus over here and then Marcus comes and chokes with Rutger. That might be worth trying. Um, yeah, I mean, just see what happens, really. I mean, we can't know. I don't remember all the AIs and stuff, so we're just going to have to yeah, we're find just, out. We're just going to have to wing it. Um, I do all this planning, but, you know, all bets are off once you hit this button. So we're seven minutes Here in. We go. We're going to get into it. I have my espresso in hand, so I'm getting hyped up. Austin Revolt. No. I've got my uh, vanilla milk. Vanilla milk? Yeah, honestly, right? The shop down the road is such a ripoff. Why? What do they do? You can spend £1.50 to get a tiny 500 milliliter bottle of Pepsi, or you can spend 10 pence less and get a full liter of vanilla milk. Huh. It's literally ridiculous. I wonder, does the UK do taxes on soda, or is it just like an import tax? Uh, there is sugar tax, yes. Yeah. Um, but I honestly, the amount of sugar that's probably in this thing... Yeah, you see, it's in the red bracket, so... <laughs> <laughs> the danger yeah. bracket. It's so nice that yeah. your country cares about how much sugar you consume. Mmm, I know. Not like I pay attention, though. 18% per 200 milliliters. <laughs> That's a lot. Like that. Oh, Merlinus. I thought about bringing Merlinus as, like, potential decoy. But... Mm, I, I, I think I've already used up all <laughs> Yeah. I also thought about bringing Boris to see, but I looked at his stats. He gets one-rounded by the Wyvern, so I'm like, all right. Not even worth the chance. Yeah, he doesn't have enough hit points Not to be bad. useful. Yeah, I mean, that's... Yeah, because we want to give the Angelic Road to Roy, so there you go. Yeah. So the first turn's going to be just, like, a lot of positioning. Yeah, definitely. It's, it's all about, you know... It's just, if anything, the enemy phase is the scariest bit. It always is. Always is. One of the um, one of the other things as well with this chapter that we'll need to take care of is just like making sure that like by turn ten when those reinforcements come from the backside that we're not in a position to um, what's it called that we're not like in like their gank range more or less. Mm. They come on turn 10, 15, and twenty. Yeah, that's what I'm seeing on my end too. I have uh, Fire Emblem W O D. The Spanish yeah, language is... <laughs> yeah, we're on the same page. Sp Fire Emblem WD, the Spanish language's most prominent Fire Emblem resource, that also now has English translations, which I didn't know until recently. Oh, uh, yeah. I would not have gotten through my Thracia Iron Man if not for World of Darkness. Good lord, that website is amazing. Yeah, it's a great, great website. Okay. I don't even know what they're talking about. I think they're talking about, like, trying to... Get back to us, Ostia. All right, now, now. This is it. All right, Marcus. All right, the, so these aren't bad numbers. I okay. Just wonder. Yeah, cause I, I remember seeing. I want to say it's Master NX. Or something oh no! Shit. <laughs> <laughs> this 
Ah! Okay. All right, we can okay. still make yeah, this we work. Can work. We can work with it. Yeah, we can make this work. Great content from Panda and Zenith. Seriously. All right, you have Javelin equipped. Um. Worst comes to worst. Can anyone else get Roy if he's underneath the knight? No, we down? fucked up. Oh, wait a second. Roy's not going to be in the right position to get Jarrah this turn. Are you sure? Can you not just put him underneath the knight with a rapier so he can block up? Um... And then the only... Because the knight will just come and attack him. As long as the mercenary can't one-round him, then he's, he's fine. Well, let's take a look at this. Shit. I can't believe I fucked that up. It's okay. Oh. It happens to the best of us. Let's see. So Roy. He's got 22 HP still. This guy's doing 19, which is really 20. Minus... Where's Roy? Six. Thirteen. So he's doing thirteen, and then. Well, provided he, he probably won't kill the knight, will he? But then there's also this oh, guy. That soldier. Hmm. Let's see. One, one, two, three, four, five. Yeah. Shit. We got Roy in the. We did this badly. Worst. All right, this is this is emblematic of how this run's going to go. Uh, okay, let's just maybe do some bits on the left side, maybe, and then it'll kind of it might jolt some jolt some tactics. All right, we're gonna put armor slayer, uh, iron sword here, and then we'll armor slayer the next turn with Rutger. Yep. Uh, we'll get Deke over here. Yeah, maybe the knight might even go for Deke. Let's see. Um. Chad's gonna go here. I think that's the torch stuff? Yeah. Yeah. I just wanna get all the stuff out of here quickly. Yeah, the house above it, I think, is a longbow. How did I screw that up? I'm so mad. <laughs> it's okay, don't worry. Dude, um, I'm so mad. Probably wanna swap that out for an iron lance just so he doesn't get too slowed down. And then if you move Marcus up one, then we can still get Jero potentially. Well, what we can do, there's a couple of things. So we can we can make this work a different way. Um, and that way would be to rescue Jero with Marcus and then drop him with someone else. Yeah. So that's not the worst in the world. And then we're going to... Yeah, we can make it work. We can, we can make this work. Let's move Alan a little bit. Yeah. God. I wonder what Alain was thinking. He's like, I don't want to go. Alright, this is feet. fine. <laughs> Two damage. Yeah, all the prep. Nice dude, all the prep right. goes out the window immediately. As soon as you press that fight button. All bets are off. All bets are off. Come on, crit. <laughs> At least he hit him. Yeah. Alright. Rutger is going to get this guy. Terrain is going to be so essential to this map. Those forests are a godsend. They really are. I just knew what they were doing. Oh, wait, hang on. Does, uh, do they come from the top, top set of villages or the middle ones? The top, top set. Ah, right. Ah. Okay, I thought it was the ones below. No. Uh huh. Where's Noah? Wait, hang on. One, two, three, four, five. That Y event is just terrifying. Alright, so now we're in trouble because this guy's in the way. So I think what we might need to do is Well Lou can potentially deal with that. Oh that's a that's a that's a good call. Lou, yeah, Lou can do that. There you go. So the hour. Oh, we can do this. Armor Slayer here. Lou here. Um, we're gonna heal up Lance with Saul. Saul at least has some vague bulk to him, unlike <laughs> our, our near miss friend Clarine. God. Dude, I was thinking about it. Deke has escaped death twice this run so far. Yeah. Um, yeah, he has. And both of them were thanks to me. <laughs> yeah. Let's see. How do you do against this guy? 17. How much defense do you have? Two. So you live. 
Because uh, I want to heal up Roy, because he might take some heat. Yeah, that is true. Leaving him on... 27 is a, the, is a nice... Uh, is it 29 or 20? 29 health. 29 is a comfortable amount of HP. Yeah. Alright, because now what I need to do is figure out how we can clear these guys and rescue Jero and drop him. So I feel like these other units that are behind are going to have to pick up a lot of the slack here. So well, that's why I'm thinking Ruka can potentially go and kill that Myrmid uh, that mercenary. Close. If he had a stronger sword. Um, Let's see. Uh, what about Lot here? Potentially hit the mercenary with Sue. Lot! Oof. Yes. Yeah, because we could do this, right? Because then we could... I think what we can do here, and this is going to be risky, right? So if Lot goes here and gets this, Lou goes here and chips the mercenary, Rutger goes here and kills him, and then Deke now, and then Marcus now, and then Lot now. Um... This is why I wish we had better two cabs. At the very least, though, these two guys are kind of safe in this little corner because they're surrounded, so they can't like go out into the wilderness. Ivan doesn't go over and yeah. start kicking Jero's ass, but yeah. So, what do you? How do you feel about that strat? In all honesty, it's the best we've got. You just need to be super conscious about who's in range of that Wyvern. Yeah. Which is a lot of people. Um, that guy's a run ender in of himself. Yeah, that's a especially Roy. Yeah, that's totally fair. And part of me like wants to keep Rutger over here to like distract these two. They go south to go and head for Chad, which they probably shouldn't. I feel like Chad should just dart over this way. Yeah. Um, alright, let's, um... How does Sue do against this guy? That puts a Rutger into Rutger kill range. Or Deke kill range. But I'm worried about putting Deke in Steel, Steel Lance range here. Yeah, because if he doesn't dodge and he suddenly gets swarmed by all the Merc, uh, the Cavs. Yeah. All right, so we're just gonna need to move. So I think. Have to commit to it. All right, I'm thinking Rutger here to distract. That's gonna be more useful, I think. Sure, you can kill all the units that way. All right. I think we've already run it through. Yeah. So let's try. We'll start with Lot. Yeah. When in doubt. Oh, oh no. Ooh, Vengeance crit. Okay. Oh, we also have Lance, so we can do this. 54 hit rate, my god. Uh, and then would have put him in Lou kill range, but... Yeah, let's try... I think I want to do Alen here and just go for this. Yeah, because then at least that puts Deke within a good... Yeah. In a good place. Nice! Okay, cool. Alright, that makes up for Lot getting hit. I am very worried about putting Deke there. The worst comes to the worst, Lance can just pull him out. That's fair, because Deke has, what, 6 defense against this guy's 23. 23 that's and that's not counting for these calves. 17. 17 plus 118 damage. Yeah, so... Well, as I say, right, what you can do is you can, you can do it with Deke. Oh, how's Marcus going to kill that guy? How does Lance do here? These guys have pretty weak hit against him. And it puts him on the forest as well. The forest is nice. Um, I really want to get Jero out of there, though. Um, God, this is terrifying. All right, let's... Um, you are just going to have to commit to that and then pull... Oh, you can pull him out with Shanna if you have to. That's fair. Soon. Let's see how this goes, is really all we can do. Man, we duffed that so hard. Um. <laughs> oh, actually, yeah, that's cool. Lou can go up there. What? Just just check what the Wyvern does to him. Yeah, that's a good call. 23. Yeah, he kills Lou in one hit. But we could also probably... So are we able to pull him out with... Yeah, because we can if we rescue Jarat with Marcus, like I'm okay with sacking Trek. 
Uh, just putting that <laughs> out there. So hyped for Trek. I was very hyped for Trek, but I also have to be realistic. Sacrifices must yeah. be made. Uh, yeah, definitely. So we can probably do this, and then... Mm, 11, 11, so that... How much do you do? 11. Okay, so we can make this happen. And then if Lance can go... One, two, three, four, five, six. Rescue. No, it's not going to be enough. Yeah, because then, the, then he won't even be on the forest. Yeah, I would need to use Roy, maybe. That's not going to be enough either. Um. Yeah, I'll shake your ass to what Sue doing. Yeah, probably Sue probably doesn't hit reliably enough. Six damage, not gonna make a difference. Sue can take a javelin from this guy though, which is pretty tight. Uh, I think Rutger at this point is just gonna have to commit to this side. And if... yeah, okay. God, twenty-seven. Hopefully that's rid our bad RNG for the next turn. Yeah, let's see. Come on. <laughs> All right. Okay, we take speed. Um. Now, let's see, yeah, because this guy, he, if I put, if I push Marcus up, he well, can't. that plus Lance is a, a kill, isn't it? 11, 11, oh, that plus Lou is a kill, but then we still, the risk that we run is that, well, no, the enemies move first, so they'll be able to, they'll go for Jero first, I think. Um, we also have to remember the Wyvern might just go for Trek, so. Well, if he does, then that's good, because that brings him away from us. Yeah. yeah, it might be worth going up there with. Um... I think Lou, and then because the gu he can't kill with the javelin. I think. Let's double check that. Six, so nineteen. Lou has no, Lou Lou lives, but that also is contingent on like these guys also have javelin. So we might have to pull him out of there, which I think is doable. So we have two reserve units to pull him out. So. Yeah. So I think that might be the play. And I want, let's see, yeah, it's got to be the Gant Lance. Oh, wait, can we just, oh, we can just do this, too. Yeah, actually, that works even better. Yeah, I think oh, that's... Hang on, hang on, hang on, wait, 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 wait. Oh, don't we need Marcus to rescue Jero? We do, but there's really no way to get this Cav and rescue Jero in the same turn. Okay, we'll just have to because... stick up there, then. Yeah, I think Marcus here on the forest... On the forest. Silverlands. That sounds like a Cluedo guess. This is what we have to do. Forest with the Silverlands. Oh, Jero is just looking at Marcus like, "Who are you?" Please save us. <laughs> so close. <laughs> I know that's ridiculous. I would recommend just pulling Deke. Out. Pulling Deke out. With Shano. That's, One, two, uh... Three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, he can, she can go up and then back down again. Fair. Maybe not in range of the mercenary. Nope. Take. Drop. Drop. That's fine. What weapon has Alain got on him? He's wielding a javelin. Okay. Um, I think that's all we are going to be able to do for now. I think making any more moves is... I don't want to do that just in case he gets then hit and then hit by the boy yeah. and hit by the cab and... Yeah. I would like to think... Let's see. Sue's only going to get hit by this guy. The Sue could potentially get hit too, so let's just switch the iron sword, iron bow. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, that's not gonna be enough. I kind of want to block though. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. I mean, if you move him one to the right, he's only in risk from the cav and the, the cav soldier and the wyvern. Which let's see, can he take this? So 18 plus 15. Which is what? 30, 
3 minus 14, which is 19. So he has, he can't take all three. But it depends on the movement order and who they go after. Yeah, we just have to see by this point. We can't. Because I also, th yeah, I also think as well, like, they might go for Roy or Saul. Or at least this guy might. This guy has more options. The Wyvern and the, the this guy don't. Ooh, Roy's in range of two ca uh, two Javelin. Actually, no, but he won't die. Yeah, okay. Let's just see. I want to see how... Okay, this guy's not going to do... Let's see. The set rate's also really shaky. So, I think I'm, I'm going to pull him up one. And leave him with a Lance. Instead of a, a Javelin. Javelin. Maybe. Give him slightly more void. Um, but it also might deter people from attacking him. Okay. Let's go with the Lance. We'll go for a Void. Right. Yeah, okay. That works for me. And then... Yeah, let's try that. Let's see what happens. Oh okay. god, oh no! Oh. Okay. Whoa, 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 okay. That's actually Hello, not. Mission. That's actually not terrible. Thank you, Jero, for setting up kills for us. Okay. She doesn't get doubled with Slim Lance. Yeah. That's fine. Uh oh, Wyvern. Oh, another one. Uh. This is fine. Calculated. <laughs> I mean, that one was actually calculated. That one was calculated. Okay, good. Jesus, Jero, don't die. If Jero dies, I'm gonna be so annoyed. No! Oh my god! <laughs> no, 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 no! No! Oh, god. The Wyvern can probably get him. Oh my god, if Jero dies. Oh, uh, I'm, I'm gonna be so sad. Yes, go for Marcus on the forest. Thank you. I don't think that guy could have gotten Jero anyway, so yeah, that makes sense. <laughs> Man, I'm so, I'm so miffed. No, 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 no. Oh! oh, he still lives. <laughs> oh my god. Like... Oh. <gasps> wow, the RNG. No, don't heal. No. Physics staffs on this chapter as well. Rebel. No. Why don't you heal? He's not gonna heal. Oh, Trek. Trek to save the day. No, he's not doing anything. Looks. <laughs> oh my god. Uh. Fear. Is Noah the only one who can recruit fur? Yes. We can we can still get Noah without getting Jero though. Okay. Um. Okay. I love the color of Fear's shirt. Yeah, it's a very nice kind of like greeny teal. Yeah, I'm super into it. Goodbye, Fear. I wish you would join here, too. Alright. We can't even reach him. Okay, so this is, this is looking real bad. <laughs> oh, it's bad. Um. I think we can reach Noah, actually. It just needs the mercenary to not be there. Yeah. But that's not important for now. The most important thing. I don't think, Jer I don't think we're gonna, they're going to make it. I don't. Do we just sack it and move on? I honestly don't think it's worth trying to get him by this point. We've done all we can. I don't think so. No. Um. They, why doesn't he have healing? That's so annoying. Trek has healing at least. Trek's at least vaguely smart. Man, I'm so bummed. I'm so disappointed in myself, man. I'm sorry. Don't apologize to me. I, um, it's fine, bro. I don't. I've made probably way more mistakes than you have, so don't worry. <laughs> Yeah, but this one's gonna lead to a death, and we didn't even get to use him, and his awesome d rank and axes. Ugh. Alright. So, I think Jero and Trek are toast. I think we just have to 
cut our losses here. As much as I want to try rescuing them, it's going to not be worth losing other units. I mean, okay, right. Let's at let's least just maybe try and think it through. Yeah. So, what can we do to get rid of? Uh, we only really need to get rid of the soldier and the knight. Roy's not in range to reach either of them, so it's got to have to be a rescue drop scenario, which we can yeah, still well, do. Ideally, we'd just get Marcus to go for Jero and then just run back. Yeah. So if some combination of units can clear out that soldier... I mean, Locke can take out the soldier by himself, surely, and probably still survive. Yeah. How does Lot do against the Armor Knight? 12, and then if Lot has... 11, 22, so he's doing 23, so 11. He can one round the Armor Knight in that spot. But then lots so really, of. We just need to yeah. Clear the soldier. Yeah, so if we do that, right, so we clear the soldier with Lou and Alan. Two cabs. Not gonna be enough. For Sue, maybe? Um, I think Lou and Alan. Yeah, that. that. And then we Lot to here. And around rescue duty for uh, Lou. Yeah, we just need to like. Because he's so good, man. He's so good. Definitely put the spare cab where that knight is to stop it from coming up and. Yeah, I agree with um, that. Um, what about Rutger? I kind of want Rutger to... Rutger's going to need to help clear some stuff out. It's not going to do enough there. Well, Rutger and... Yeah, that mercenary is the priority. He's going to come through in our day. Alright, so... Let's try this. Yeah, so... Sue can pull back. Deke with the Iron Blade, perhaps? Not enough. Yeah, because Noah can sur probably survive a turn. Uh, dude, I, I'm so torn. I'm so torn. Because also we have to recruit Jero and then heal him. Which... Well, that's fine, because let's think about it. So if Marcus goes 1-2 to pick him up, He's got six movement left. Mm -hmm. So one, two, three, four, five, six. He can get to where Roy. Yeah. Then rescue drop him. Yeah, but then we need to pull Lou out as well. With a. Which Kalorine could potentially do. This is terrifying, honestly. Um, I think. We're. Someone's dying. I'm just putting that out there. I think we need to heal a lot because he's going to be under stress. If we're going to if we're going to attempt this then yes, he will need This might be lot. I'm I'm thinking Saul. I'm thinking Saul because we might want Chlorine to pick up Fair, and fair. Jero. We might also want Chlorine to heal Jero too. Yes. All right. So, All right. Lou Lou's gonna need to dodge this. If he doesn't, then we'll have to abort the plan. Yep. Any mistakes here? Nice! Okay. Yeah, we do have a way out at least right now. Yeah. Okay. That's the thing, we need to just not push it further than we can pull back. Yeah, so let's see. Alen. Or Lance, 84. Who is more reliable here? Okay. Lance here. No! Ah. Okay, ah. Another... Ah. okay. 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 Wow. Okay. He's really eager to uh, to help us out here. Yeah. Let's see. Just get a crit. Just get a crit. Dodge it. Nice. Lot. Lot! Yes! Lot! Yes! Alright. Okay. Alright. Alright, rescue mission. Rescue. Get him out. 
Yeah, so now... Do we do... Just bring him all the way down. I think here. Drop here. Talk with Roy. No. Because we want him to heal. So I think we'll pull back a little bit more. Yes, pull him down to that bottom tile. But I want to put Marcus in a good spot. So I'm thinking... Oh, actually, let's do this here. Marcus isn't going to die, though. I know. That's why I want Marcus in front. Because he might block others from dying. So maybe... Oh, I have an idea. Let's go here. And then we pull up with Alen, drop, here, Jero here. What's nice is that Jero also still has movement. So we can use him this turn because of the way green units work. So I think this. Take. Yeah. Drop. And then I kind of want to pin this guy. Yeah, that's fine. Can the archer get him? One, two, three, four, five, one, two. No, the arch can't get Yeah, him. so I think this is fine. Yeah, pin him. Pin him there. And then... Talk. Ah! Oh. Uh. Jero's like, thank you! Yeah. Impressive. For Lord Hector. Yeah, we're doing this for Hector. No, I didn't give one about Hector. <laughs> <laughs> we're doing this for us. We're doing this for Jero. Holy shit. You, man. All right. Um, We're going to need to pull Lou out of there with uh, Shanna. I'm Just go straight south. Yeah, I think... Let's see, how much does Chad take from this guy's javelin? Chad survives. So I'm kind of going to think... I'm thinking this. Wait, hang on, hang on. I was gonna say you could move Shanna down. So he needs four movement, then she moves three down, one, two, three. So she can move to the tile where Clarine is now. And block. She's not in range of the archer in that spot, and this way we can move Clarine up to heal up Jero. I like that move. Yeah. Ah We got him. Welcome to the club, Jero. Oh my Sorry god. To, to leave your friend Trek, but Sacrifices have to be made for the greater good. Let's see. If, let's see if they even go for Trek. Um, so now you're saying pull out Lou? Yes. I'm worried about Clarine, though. Because or... uh, Rutger and uh, Deke can take out the mercenary between them, can't they? I kind of want to... out the way. Oh. Well, also, we can use Jero. True, but then what's Rutger doing to contribute for the turn? Not dying. Um... So you're saying Deke here? And then... Or Deke goes where Shanna is, and then Rutger kills? Yeah, just make sure... Just check what the damage is on that, those calves. 16. Minus... So it's 10... Or nine. It's a little dicey, regardless. And this wyvern just has so much. It's gonna be a little dicey. But I agree with you that getting Lou out of there is a good idea. Yeah, because I mean the wyvern could just go over there and just tap him with a lance and he'll die. What's the hit rate on it actually? Seventy-six. With a steel lance. Same. And what? Lose a void. 27, so it's in that dicey 50 range. Yeah, Plus, there's the archers the and stuff. Range, Lou's yeah. gonna be, unless we. No, Lou's should be pulled out. Yeah, I agree. Lou is not worth trying to get Jero a free turn. Yeah. I mean, unless you. Because we can always pull Shanna down. The thing is that Shanna can't rescue drop and heal. And D can't get into range to help out who there. Says she, who says she has to drop anything? Oh. Because we want Shanna back. Because I want Shanna to block this armor knight. And I want Jero here. Ooh, 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 ooh. You could rescue Shanna with uh, Lou with Shanna. Mm -hmm. Bring it. Bring her down three tiles, and then get Deke to go one, two, three. Ooh, four, I like take that. Lou. And then that leaves Shanna free of having to rescue someone, but she's still in kill range for the night. Sue is in, like, a bad spot, though. She doesn't get doubled, but it puts Sue in a risky spot. 
and Saul. Okay, well, I'd rather risk Shanna than Sue, so... Oh, but then again... I don't want Lou to die. Let's see. Well, Rutger... I don't want... Rutger... I don't feel... Rutger needs to heal. But I like this idea of Shanna to... Because Lou can... What Lou can do... Oh, Lou's still in range of this. Oh, yeah. So, you know what? Actually, this is what we'll do. Hear me out. So, we'll take Shanna. She'll rescue Lou. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Deco's here. Put Picks up Lou. Drops Lou here. Lou doesn't die to the Javelin. And then Jirogo's here, and this blocks the Wyvern from getting to Clarine or Lou. Excellent. I think uh, I think right. that's the move. So let's try this. That is gonna be the move. And now Jero. Um, actually, no, that doesn't help because Lorena is in range of the wyvern now. But um, oh, She's I goof. Let's uh, do jab. Actually, let's do steel. Uh, javelin for avoid. Javelin, javelin for avoid. And then let's see. Can he canto now? Okay, so Ooh, going up top to that wyvern. Go where the one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Could still javelin Kareem. But even if Jiro you put in there. Six, nineteen. How much defense do you have? Two. She still dies to a javelin, but it's lower likelihood. Yeah, I would just put Jiro, ironically, back where he was before. Mm, but then, Clarine might die regardless, honestly. Does that mean we don't get Klein? Ugh. I think this might be safer, because at least the Cav can't do it, so she's only taking... Yes, that's true. Yeah, okay, alright, that's fine by me. And then Rutger to block Sue, I think. The, the, the Merc will still go around, and the... Uh, one, two, three, four, five... The Arch can get her as well. But I mean, hopefully some of them will just go for Noah, Noah because he can't retaliate. Yeah, um, so I think heal with Rutger and leave him on the forest just in case. Yeah, that's gonna have to be it, really. Yeah. Alright, that was a turn. A lot can go wrong still. Oh, he runs away. Goes for Saul. Oh, don't crit Saul. Don't double Saul. Okay. It's okay, Saul's not the end of the world, though. No, it's not. We at most lose a men's staff. Okay, Trek. Good. I think Saul might, might be out for the count. Ah, uh, Clarine! Oh my god. I'm actually stood up right now, I'm so tense. Uh oh, Lance. The Lance lot support that never was. Okay. It still could be. <laughs> Man, this game is such a slugfest. These hit rates are so scary. Dude, they're just awful. Next Thracia right. 99s look reliable. I know, seriously. Wow, Alan! Wow, we're getting some stats, finally! Yeah. Okay, goes for Noah. Nice. That's good. That's what we want. Okay, Saul could be toast. No. Woo! <laughs> Just do that three more times! Come on, come on! No! no! <laughs> Such is his fate. Uh, no! It, he died for the greater good. Ah oh, man, that's a that's a no, tough one. I... Oh, she still gets. No. <laughs> no! <laughs> no! We lost Klein. I don't even care about Klein. We lost Klein. Dude, we lost both of our healers this map too. Oh my god. I'm kind of knelt down, gripping onto my chair right now. Oh my god. Did that just happen? Oh, okay, let's sit down. Let's be a normal person. Dude, that went so poorly, but we were due for some bad luck. That's been a long time coming. Look at this setup! <laughs> Holy shit! So we traded 
so we traded uh, uh, Saul and Clarine for Trek and Jero and Noah. Yeah. Oh goodness. Um. You know what the mistake was, dude? I shouldn't have pinned the the soldier. I should have put Alan here. Well, there's no. S no, we can still get Klein. Roy can talk to him. Oh, Roy can talk to Klein. Okay. Oh, thank God for that. Yeah, I know, but how are we gonna heal ourselves this, the rest of this map? The wyvern needs to die. There's two of them. All right, so. Okay, right. Let's just let's just take this as it comes. Right. What's Lot gonna do first of all? Lot's gonna crit kill this guy. I think what we need to do, dude, is just like pull and like hide in these corridors. Okay. Um, so... Oof. Okay, uh... This is so bad. I think this might be the move. Lou first. But what's Lou doing to the... I want... I need help. I mean, Deke can... Yeah, Deke... Oh, Rutger has the armor slayer. Um... I'm thinking Lou and Lot can take care of this wyvern. Yeah, that gets rid of our biggest threat. Yeah. Alright. Oh my god, dude. First, we're just gonna do this. Just help me. Just get the killing edge. Man, I'm so bummed. That's uh, That hurts so much. I know, my soul just fell out of my body when Soul died. Ugh. Okay, let's just let's just move on though. Can't get too just we gotta yeah. get through this chapter for the sake of the run. Yeah, we have to do it. Come on, lot. Crit? Lot, come on. Alright, we can still still kill him. Still got Lou on, on standby. Yeah. Terrible. Absolutely terrible. Okay. Absolutely terrible. <laughs> Um, we still have Ellen. We still have Ellen on reserve, thankfully. All right, now. I think we just need to like get into like a very turtly defensive position over here. For sure. I mean, Roy just needs to get out of their full stop. So get Marcus to rescue Roy and just pull him. I don't know. Uh. Lance. Then, Alain. It's just not even worth trying. And then... Shanna just needs to get out. Yeah, so does Sue. Alright, let's do this, because we can still talk and then Kanto. Trek. <laughs> Okay, I guess. Everything's gone horribly. <laughs> Help. <laughs> no, Alright. Okay. Um... Oh, Trek has a vulnerary, thankfully. Alright. We're all good. Oh my god, dude. This is terrifying. And Roy can just sort of slot in. What turn is it? All right, we still- it's only turn four! <laughs> We're a long way off those cabs yet, don't worry. Oh my god, dude. I should've just- uh, I can't- I can't say anything. I should've- I thought I should've reset after I made that first mistake, but that's how Iron Man works. That's how it goes. No resets. No regrets. All right, let's just make- regrets, but- but- <laughs> we just gotta get on with it. Yeah, that- that's- the mantra, right? Just gotta get on with it. So Sue's over here. Uh, let's put Marcus here. Yeah, because then I guess... This guy will run back for a heal. Oh, God. No! Okay, Marcus can't die. This is absolutely terrible. Okay, now Roy... Peels over here. And then Deke. Let's 
what it's gonna have to be, I think. There's really not much else we can do. We might not get fear. No, it's just doing his best. Ah. Uh. <sighs> He did his best. Yeah, you tried, man. You no, we don't get fear. Best. That's such a bummer. Yeah, that is an L. Calculated risk. Thank you, Chad. Thanks, Chad. Oh, no, Lot. Dude, if Lot got credit right there... <laughs> that would just be the worst. <laughs> that would have sucked so much. Lot's actually still in danger, I think. Lot? Oh, good lord. I don't think anyone else can attack him. Yes. We had the foresight to use Elen to block him, so... <sighs> okay. Oh, my god. Okay. This... Terrible. Terrible, terrible, terrible. Why did IS Elen put so many be... javelins in this map? Whose idea was this chapter in general? I love well, this chapter. But it's, We're kind of bunched up, so that helps. Yeah, so this is good. We're in, like, the best positioning we've been in. Um, it's not saying much, but... We also don't have anyone to heal a lot, so he has to heal himself. Um, Everyone's got to heal themselves by this point. Yeah. Um, Iron Blade, maybe, on the Archer. Yeah, I like that. Well, even if we did lose a couple of healers, um, we still have Deke, uh, Ruger, um, Lou, Lot. Yeah, we lot. We still have Lot. <laughs> lot, so all is not lost. We have yeah. We still have Ellen on the bench. We can probably early promote Lou. Uh, yeah, yeah. Nice. Cause... That's a shout. Um, what else? Cecilia quite late. Uh, it's not even... Uh, what healers do we even get? Um, let's have a look. Uh, Effie... I can't remember what characters are in. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven... This guy's only got a Steel Lance. Alright, so... How does Roy do over here? Not terribly. I think we should do this and then Luke can kill. Dodge it. Man, it's so scary. Dude, no, having no healers is the worst. Ugh. The next healer we get, not counting Lelina, is Cecilia. That's so far away! Yep. <laughs> the next person who comes with a stat rank. Oh my god, this is totally just gonna like be Turtle Central. Um... It's a good thing that Ellen with a men staff and stuff. It's a good thing she procced a couple of magic growths. I don't know if Ellen has the staff rank to use Mend. She definitely does, because I've used it a couple times, I'm sure. Okay. Ellen, uh, sorry. Mend is, uh, C rank. You could always get Jiro to trade the Silver Lance off, and... Can Jiro use the Silver Lance? Yeah, Jiro... He has A... Yeah, Jiro's dope. Um... Lot needs to heal. Uh, yeah, Elen comes with a D ring, so we're good. So I think Trek here to block. Yeah. And then. Uh, what is Jero and Marcus' stats side by side again? 10, 12, 13, 9, 14, 12. Marcus is faster. Yeah, he's a little bit faster. And marginally stronger, but that's skill. Um, yeah, you could always just trade the Silver Lance and just try to just take out the cab. I think that might be the play here. I love Jiro's palette. It is a very nice palette. Come on, crit. <laughs> oh god. Why can't all the units be like the paladins? <laughs> yeah, why can't they all be good? 
All right, now. Lot needs lots safe here. Lots slow recovery. You're getting there. I mean, this is what real warfare is like. Yeah, really. Oh, Educate. Okay. Um. Oh, it's just worth leaving that to the enemy phase. If the gets hit by that, he's toast because they'll just get pelted by three javelins. Yeah, that's totally fair. We'll put Lance... Putting Lance behind him in hopes that Lance will get hit instead. Yeah. And then... We could have Sue 1v1 this archer. Yeah. So the Roy doesn't take the heat. Give it a go. And then Chad. Give the killing edge to Roy. Yeah. No, give, oh, Killing Edge needs to get to Rutger ASAP. Alright, I think this is as good as it's gonna get. That is as good as it's gonna get. Dodge it, Deke. Nope. Oh, that's fine. Crit him? No. With that. Might be another Deke having to survive on sorts of calves again. Uh, oh. uh. Good. Okay. Uh. Oh. I'm okay with that outcome. Stupid. Stupid. Ah. Oh no. Trek. Trek's got a nice palette as well. Tre oh, yeah, the, all the alien guys have nice palettes. Man, we lost Noah and we lost Fear. I was Trek the one to survive. <laughs> yeah, I was Trek the one to survive. <laughs> the one in the most danger. This Noah is... could use the killing edge as well. Noah, Plus dude, yeah, Noah has sword. C rank. Yeah, Noah's dope. Ugh. It's okay, we'll have root guess so we won't need fur. We'll say we say that now. We're not out of we're not out of the woods yet. No 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 no. No. Heal him. This is terrifying. That's just a that's just a, a cherry on top, isn't it? Dude, we've been going for an hour and this is we're still here. <laughs> It's okay, the, the chapter might pick up a bit after this. We just gotta make a mad push for the top. Yeah, because we're getting... Close to those... Dangerously close to the calves. Um, Roy can pin this guy and just whittle him down, I think. I'm fine with that. Mm. It might be worth splitting this up into two halves, maybe. Two parts? So that, yeah. Okay, right, so, yeah. why burn? Why Let's burn? see how much we get done, because I need to leave in, like, 40 minutes, probably. Yeah, that's fair. Alright. Um, 13. Can we get Lance out of the way, and, uh, sorry, Trek out of the way, and Jero in? Yeah, let's, um, I think Trek up here. Yeah, give him Vulnerary, tank some hits. Don't particularly mind what happens to him. Probably asleep on his horse anyway. Yeah, let's see. I'm doing. I'm down with this. Okay. Ah. What's your What's your plan with Lot? Lot needs to heal again. Okay. Paladin versus a wyvern. And then Rutger. What about giving him the killing edge first? Oh, good call. I'm willing to try this. Thing. Yep. Do your thing, Rutger. Crit. Come on. Yes. Okay. This is what it's come down to, man. Relying on crits. And then Deke. Nope. Lou. It's got to be Lou. Has to be. Unless. Unless, yeah, one of the calves can do something about it. Two. No, those hit rates are too dodgy. Or maybe Sue? Sue could do it, and then we can rescue her out of there. And yep. then use Lou to, like, whittle down something else, maybe. Yeah. Actually... 
No, I think it should be Lou. There's uh, too much that maybe. can go. There's too much that can go wrong with that move. Lou from the forest. Yeah, that's smart. Somehow he has more hit. My God. What a train wreck. Okay. Now. I like this move. Iron Sword, maybe. Can achieve the same result. No. Gant's Lance. Anything with high hit. Yeah, the Gant Lance works. And these guys all have lances or swords anyway, so this is probably better. As much as I want to raise Marcus's axe rank. Oh, we can't focus on that now. Yeah. We don't have such a. Oh, God. A live rank. Oh, God, Marcus, please. Please. It's gonna have to be because that mage can just dispatch anybody. Yeah. It's a bit of a risk it's for D. Necessary. Let's do this precautionary trade. What are we saving? The steel blade. The steel uh, blade, which we haven't even used. We... It seemed a lot. It seemed like much better of an idea in practice. In theory, sorry. And get a lens come up around the side. Heal up. Oh, okay. And then. A lens can go here. Yeah, block it all off. Yeah, I think that's fine. And then Lot. Lot's gonna take back this for now, just in case. Yeah. And then Roy is just going to work on this guy. <laughs> <laughs> He'll try. Sue's going to go over here. I don't even know what's in here. Elixir, maybe? Blue gem? Hero Crest. Oh, Hero Crest! Dude, do we just insta-promote Lot right now? Oh, Lot? Not even. Give him a bow. Lot can kill the Wyverns. <laughs> the Wyverns aren't here anymore. Doesn't matter. Uh, okay, yeah, we can do this with Shanna too. Uh, yeah. Cause that archer's pinned. He's just trying to hide in this person's house, and Shanna's just trying to poke her. Face yeah. Okay, well, this is a big turn for Deke. Not it's a great not start. A big turn for Deke. This is. Deke, Deke died for our sins, I think. Elfire! Oh, what? Whoa, Trek! <laughs> Trek! Okay. Trek knows what the stakes are. Uh, they're going for Trek. That's glorious. I hope. Mm. They'd rather attack Trek than Deke. That's so interesting. Dodge it. Ooh. Nice. I think we're safe. I think we're safe. 47 is a scary number. Deke? Oh. Deke wants to live, man. Deke wants to live. No! <laughs> I'm actually fine with this. That's, yeah, that's probably the best person he could heal. It's okay. What I want to know what turn we're on. How far are we away from those Silver Lance calves? Oh, it's only one, but it's four calves. Okay, we have three turns. Let's just keep chipping away at this guy. Mostly Stab to dis in the face. yeah, mostly to get some experience on them, but also to distract them, the healer. Uh, this is the start of the Shanna Roy support. God, all right. Now Lot can contribute, I think now, and we can push. So I'm thinking. I think Lot. Halberd lot? Ooh. That was 65. This is a That's, little bit better. That feels, that feels safer. Let's go for it. Yeah. Nice dodge. Not. Lots. I like how the sound effect of uh, when the cab misses lot times up so perfectly with the music that it cuts out the note. I think oh, I yeah. Noticed that. Let's see, and then... 
think... Just have to break out the killing edge at all costs. I think DQ here, and then killing edge. Yeah. Yeah, you got killing edge the mercenary. Yeah, so let's do DQ here with the iron blade. Crit. Oh my god, Rutger. Gee, thanks. Alright, now... Lou. Yeah. Finally. Big levels? Oh, we can promote Lou next soon. Uh, okay, there we go. Yeah, we'll take that. Now, Marcus needs to heal himself this turn. I think Jero here. I think that might be the best move. Yeah, same thing. Let's go for this. Yeah, so this is like... I think this is going to spark debate, right? Did we make the right trade? Because I think we could have yes. saved everyone else if we just, like, sacked Jero and Trek. We might have been able to get Noah instead, but it was. Yeah, I, I'm honestly wondering if we did. Um... Yeah, it's a tricky thing to to judge because um, there's still just like a lot that. Chad's gonna just keep moving up here. Yeah, there's a lot that we could have. Um, let's see, no one's up here, right? You can't reach. Yeah. We don't want to pull that armor net, and you need to heal. Sue needs to deliver that hero crest. <laughs> yeah, dude, there was. That was tricky. There was like. There's no. I mean, one, there was just no good way to handle it, frankly. track Dude, I think Trek wants to be used. Yeah, well shame I don't want to use him. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, man. Trek's been the hero so far for us. Well, here in inverted commas. <laughs> Is anyone a hero on this chapter? No, I don't think so. Let's see, can we take out... Let's try this, I think. Come on, Alan! Nice! Yes! Okay, Alan, you're pulling yourself back up. I'm worried about that wyvern up top. Oh yeah, there is another one. Things are looking up, though. Things are looking up. No! <laughs> that... Cleric would gladly run into the middle of the, his enemies to heal him. Now that is a man I respect. Uh, we're still good. Okay, things are actually looking kind of peaceful for one. Yeah, this is actually shaping up to be okay. Come on, get it into Roy kill range at least. Thank you. Yes. Some juicy experience for Roy this chapter. <laughs> A level, finally. Strength! Alright. Yes. Getting some muscle, finally. Alright, now... Sue. I love, like, the Nomad Horse, like, clicky hoop sound effect. Yeah. But now look at it. What did you say? <laughs> They're all these dead healers. <laughs> Alright. Oh, I just can't... Oh, just the moment that the wyvern just killed Clar Oh, I don't know. Can't think about it, can't think about it. Just yeah. Press on. Yeah. Oof, wow, look at him doubling. Yeah, saving Lou is also a good move, I think. This Lou's been very blessed by the RNG. Well, 
Yeah, no, he has actually. I wonder what he's uh, looking at compared to the averages. Yeah. Oh god. Come on. All right. Ooh. 14 speed D. That's so good. All right, we still have two turns. We have plenty of time to get out of here. Okay, Rutger can do that. Kind of want Lot to get the kill. Actually, who needs the experience more? Lot doesn't. I think it should be one of these two. Finally, get this guy out of my face. Now... All right, this... Those guys don't look quite as scary. Okay, so I think Marcus... Let's see, who has... Oh, let's do... This. Actually, no, this is fine. Send Marcus to the arena for some glory. <laughs> yeah, we're, this is good. we're gonna have to arena grind to get through the rest of the game, guys. That, that'll be a whole episode. <laughs> That's it. <laughs> Build up that lot land support. All right. Trek. Trek can go here to block this guy from attacking Chad. And then we're going to send Trek and Chad shopping. Jero can chill over here. And then Rutger. Rutger needs a heal. And I don't think we should promote Rutger yet. But it might be a good idea too soon. Oh yeah, he's what? not even level ten yet. Uh, I don't know. I'm taunting Rutger and D. I think Rutger's extra crit's gonna be more valuable. You think? I do, yeah. Nice, Marcus. Nice. Big levels for Marcus. Rez, okay. Mage killer, Marcus. <laughs> I can be on board with this. Rez, thanks. Proven his usefulness time and time again. Yeah, Marcus is probably our most reliable unit for dealing with magic users. He doesn't take crit, nor does he take much damage. Yeah, because he's got pretty decent luck. There we go, Trek. Good old Trek trying his best. Alright, so let's do this. Visit. Uh, Physic? Physic. For, the heal for all the healers I don't have. Uh, that's tragic. Alright, now... Lot? Lot? I think... Killer Axe Lot. Hope for the crit. Uh, does he not have the hammer? Oh no, Roy's still got the hammer, hasn't he? Yeah. Where is Roy? Oh, wait, we could do this, right? We could do this. Check out that strat. <sighs> My hat's off to you there, Panda, honestly. Uh, so good. You see the times two and you're just like, yep, no, that's going to work. Oh, uh, that, that was satisfying. Now, Jero. <sighs> What's that? Let's see, what do you got for me? An elixir, that's nice. Elixir. Yeah, because she said in the conversation, it's top secret recipe. Yeah, let's um dump the steel lance, because I think we need the healing more of this chapter right now. Oh, 100%. And uh, what lots, um, lots of promotion gains are. Yeah, let's see. Rutger, oh, let's try this out. What? Okay, guess how much HP you lot gets on promotion. Like six. More. Eight. He gets eight HP, dude. Lot. Yeah, I know. When do we get Plus the three next hero? Skill. When do we get the next hero crest, though? Uh, brilliant question. I will find out. All right. I kind of think I'm gonna send Alan to get this house, which may seem counterintuitive, but it's also because he can get away the fastest. Yeah, it means if they show up, then he can kind of move move off again. Do we send Lou to the arena? No. <laughs> well, to be fair, he probably wouldn't do too badly, but... Um, right, Binding Blade. Um, chapter... 7... Chapter 11A and 10B. 
All right. I think we get three throughout the course of the game. Mm -hmm. Four, or infinite if you go to the secret shop, but I don't even remember where it is. Yeah. I don't know if I have enough money to go to the secret shop. <laughs> yeah, we're going to need all the money we can get. Uh-oh. Yeah, you'll see the look uh -oh. on my face. When we get hit from behind, it's going to suck. <laughs> it's going to absolutely suck. Long bow, I think. A bow I made. Very useful, don't you think? Yeah, with its, like, 45 hit right away. Something stupid, yeah. 55, yeah. Uh, 55, same as a steel land. Alright, we gotta watch out for this guy. This guy's totally for lot. 100%, as are all the calves. Enemy face lot with a javelin. Lot. It does make it through this chapter without healers. No. Uh, Marcus. And Marcus Talu. Marcus is just invincible. Who do you think will last longer out of Shero and Marcus? Dude, I don't even want to make that bet. Honestly. <laughs> I'm not I'm taking... Like, who's usability? I mean... Jero's on paper better, I think, but I definitely have an, an attachment to Marcus. Yeah, he's been there since day one. Wow, the victory music's <laughs> kicking in for about. I don't know if that's long. accurate. <laughs> I don't know if definitely we should. Definitely not. I still feel no less stressed than before. Yeah. I still remember the funniest thing I've ever seen was when. I was watching, like, Mangz's uh, yeah. Iron Man deaths, and I saw that he promoted, uh, he promoted, uh, what's his name? Ah, uh, the, uh, Bath, or Bath, or, I don't know what you call him, the Blue yeah. Knight, to a general on the chapter 8. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> got killed, that's literally two turns afterwards. That's terrible. So I'm just hoping that doesn't happen to us. Oh, I shouldn't have equipped the, the hammer, that was dumb. Hammer moment. Lot, though, big levels. Big First level, level of the... On. That's a big level. You know he's gonna have 50... No, 14 speed on promotion. Oh, these aren't ambush spawns. That's nice of you, game. Nice and in invert commas. Yeah. Okay, we're in a decent spot to deal with them. We're gonna funnel them all over this the way. Has this silver it's this silver guy. Cap, silver lands. This guy. Alright, let's see. Sue... Sue? Come on. Ah. Why does she have a blue outline around her feet? That's really <laughs> jarring. Oh, it's just going to have to be Lou and Lot. The two MVPs. The MVPs. <laughs> the double L's. Double L. That sounds like us this chapter. The double L. Oh, God. Terrible. Absolutely terrible. Uh... How does Luttrek do? No. Uh, Marcus. Yeah, let's try this. That's worth a try. At least puts him in comfortable range for Lot to kill with the Iron Axe. Yeah. It's all about feeding Lot as much as possible. Yeah. Realistically, though, we should give some kills to Rutgers so we can promote him. Comfortably. As you like. Yeah. That was big. Okay, now. Alright, now we're pretty much safe. Well, reinforcements do come from the top, don't forget. They come from the top if we're in range. Look at Lot doubling the priest. He's got no. <laughs> <laughs> the way that he just missed and then hovered there for a second or so. Oh, Roy. Roy's just inhumane. Just slaying a defenseless man. It's all Roy's done this chapter. Have you seen that FE6 reskin? That every time I think Roy gets like five levels, uh, and when he promotes, he grows more of a beard and grows more angry looking. Ah, I have not seen I that. I actually don't know how they did it. But it's so funny. Alright. So what we're going to do now is we're going to send Jero over here to buy go shopping. Vendor. So what was it? Two Thunder Tomes. Yeah, let's see. It. My list. It, well, my list has to change now. 
Oh, we have plenty of money, though, so I think two Thunder Tomes. A fire. Fire, fire as well. Yeah, we need um another heal staff. Another men staff. I think we're fine on vulnerabilities. Let's buy another men staff just to be safe. Yeah, in case we lose that one. Yeah. Uh, what's the cav range? Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, zero. One, two, three, cav four, five, six, seven. That's okay. And then. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, so let's go here. Uh, oh, hang on, hang on. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, because this two, guy won't reach him, and then this guy's going to okay. javel him, javelin him from far away, probably. So, Jiro okay. should be okay. That works for me. I just got a ping from the Vision Quest server. Oh, God. Whatever could it be? Let's see, Cell... Let's see, we need, um, let's see, how many, I didn't, oh, javelins, three javelins. And then, um, we'll buy another iron lance just to be safe. I wish it sold swords. Oh no, that one. That's the other sword. armory. So just Shanna. Buy as many iron swords as you physically can hold. Yeah, one, two, three. Four, and then, no, not Iron Blade, Steel Swords. Three of these. Yeah. And then Iron Axes. How many and did I need? As well. Yeah, let's see. One, I'm need the two, the paper. two, three, four. Alright, I think that's enough. And then, um... Yeah, I think we, we got everything we needed, and we still have plenty of money left over, which is a nice place to be. At um, least Roy's rich, and he's not like Lee, who has to just run off, run off no money. Yeah, alright. Lot's gonna start down here. Enemy phase, halberd time. Lance to support? <laughs> yeah. Uh, get that man to drink a vulnerary. Yeah, Lou needs some health. This is gonna be a big healing turn, I think. Slurp, slurp. What even is a vulnerary? I don't even know, man. I always imagined it was something you drink, but then I found out it was, I think it was some medicine or something. Yeah, it's like, I don't know, I think like herbal medicine that you apply to wounds or something. I always thought it was a drink as well, but I don't know. Yeah, because elixir is definitely a drink. Yeah. All right. All right. Lot show us. Yo, if he manages to kill all of these cows, we should promote him. <laughs> <laughs> Every single last one of them. Alright, let's um let's see how this goes. What? Look at that oh, dodge. Look at that hit rate, that's so nice. Yes! Lot. Hooray. Bro. Lost not getting much XP anymore. What? What was that bullshit? Him at all. What, what was that okay. garbage? Was that the Silver Lance one? No, this is the Silver Lance one. Ooh. Um, I'm thinking Lot goes here. Yeah, okay. And then we do like this crazy rescue chain to get Jero out of there. So watch this. Ooh, okay, we can do that too. But let's, is uh... That beast? I think that's beast support, isn't it? It is a beast support. So let's do this instead. Everyone ganks until the two cows start supporting each other. Yeah. <laughs> Trek's just heading off. Uh, this actually... Uh, I would actually, yeah, I'd... One, two, three, four, five, rescue six... And bring it back up a time. Yeah. Now that is pretty galaxy brain. You can't pick up. Oh, you can pick up a lot. Wow. Chad's on the sh Chad's on the shop. For a minute, then I thought you meant the shop on the left. I was like, what? <laughs> no. Yeah, no. The fact that Dick can lift up a unit. 
Yeah, no yeah. shit, they're gonna get more difficult. <laughs> yeah, Alan, I think you had a plenty of challenge this map. Oh, this is where they're like, no, I should sacrifice myself. I should sacrifice myself. No, I should. Aw, oh, that's nice. Red and green cav, bros. Aw. Oh, yeah, because Lance is actually a foreigner, isn't he? Yeah. I think you're right. House for A, yeah. Where he's from? Nice. That's gonna be helpful. Alright. Now. Silver Lance guy. Lou. I don't trust that at all. No, I just, I just wouldn't. I honestly just wouldn't. Yeah. Who has the. Okay, we can at least do this. Because you can attack Marcus only. Oh, look at that. Nice. Well done. Yeah, just be careful about moving him rain in case the reinforcements appear. Yeah. So are we going to funnel everyone around the right? Yeah. Because there's going to be those reinforcements from the top. I see. Okay, Marcus, okay. Let's see how it is. Look at Lot, though. And then, oh, would look. It not, would just it... get ready for the strat, Zenith. Just get ready for this. Okay, okay. I trust you. 8% hit, though. Look at Lot. Fighter. <laughs> Are you seeing what I'm seeing? Oh. My God. Man. Yes! I thought there's just the weight there for the HP to deploy. Really dig the axe in there. And then Rutger can get the kill. Yeah, Maybe I think... Boost him up to level 10. Yeah, this should help him. All oh, that 20 <laughs> damage. Big level. Alright. Big level. Strucker's not... Time to promote. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, now we should start... Moving. Boy, give me the hero crest. Oh, more so. <gasps> Does that lot and lance? It is. is that a lot land support? Is that what is that, is that what I think? I don't know what happened there. I think my mic cut out. Roy and Lance can support. Oh my. We'll hold off on that one. Roy taking the lead. Yeah. I Is don't it... even know what Lance and Lot talk about. No, it's not. Wait, it's not? No. No. I know, tragic. What are you doing? Reinforcements just spawn from them. They get come from the top right, I believe. We might even be able to finish this fish out this chapter before the other calves appear. Yeah. My god, dude. I can't believe what happened, but we made it work. I gotta say. Yeah, I mean, if it wasn't for your crazy thinking, we probably wouldn't have made it out. Yeah, I think the, the big debate, though, is going to be... Holy crap. Look how many enemies! <laughs> All of a sudden. Wow. I'm fairly sure the music is actually just gonna go back to normal now. Yeah. Yep. <laughs> We're back. Alright, so at the very least, we can use someone to choke all the calves here. I think Lot's the guy for the job. Oh, 100%. And then over here, it's gotta be Marcus. Marcus with a javelin. Marcus, yeah, Marcus can heal up. Nice. You got a javelin. Yes, he does. We'll get Trek Wait. over. Trek. We'll get everyone else just ready to go. There's no time to play games. <laughs> you get the chance. Oh, God. Oh, my God, I love that. I might make that an edit on my channel. <laughs> Shanna. 
Shanna's not gonna be doing too much. Um, Deke needs a heal. Who's got the heals though? All right, Jero has a heal. This is why we needed to uh, Melinus. <laughs> yeah, this is why we would have brought should have brought Merlinus. You're right. Uh, let's see. Trade. Take the halberd because you're not gonna need that. That's it belongs to Lot. And then Alan. And then we'll just chill. Yeah, we'll chill like this, I think. I'm trying to remember what Ruckus sounds like in Heroes. Imagine it's the I'm same voice actor. Just... The Shadow. I'm wondering who, like, what Shadow's voice actor's actually been in. Um... Oh, look at Marcus doubling this guy. Putting in work, as per. Per use. Alright, I'm less scared of those soldiers, I think. Steel Ants. These guys are slow. Elfire. Let's see, how does Marcus fare against these guys? Okay, so he's, been, he's almost always been voiced by a guy called Kirk Thornton. But now he's voiced by Jason Griffith. Hmm. Gr Griffith. Barrier. Alright, so... I'm a little scared here, because there's a lot of heat. Um, I think the move might be to peel and just funnel everyone up here for now. You get what I'm saying? Yeah, no, I hear you. One, two, three, four, five. Alright, so... Yeah, so let's do... Jero. I don't think anyone has heals left on them. No, I think that's that. I mean, Shanna. Just make sure that Deke doesn't take too much damage so you can armor slayer the boss. That's totally fair. Okay, now. By this point, we won't. As well. Did what? I, did we've gotten to the point where we have to like micromanage hit points? <laughs> that is FE6. Roy's like, where are you taking me? The throne's not this way. Track up here. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah. And then. We're actually going to end up having to turtle in. Into this little tiny throne room. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. That would be amazing. Here they come. Here come the boys. Come on, Marcus, do your thing. Okay. We can work with this. Yeah. We can do this is supposed to be the easy part of the chapter. <laughs> well, I would argue that no part of this chapter is exactly easy. Let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, so we just need to block this hole. Yeah, I'd suggest putting him... Where Deke is now. Yeah, lot. As possible. That'd be the ideal position. Yeah. yeah. I'm a little. I think we can put ourselves in a position to um, because look how what does he do here? That's actually not terrible, but it is scary. So I think. This is so sad. <laughs> this is the saddest this is, how it goes. <laughs> this is the saddest strategizing I've ever had to do. God. And Roy is conveniently right there. Nice. Alright. Chad finally gets a weapon. Yep. Now... I just realized Jero's got the halberd. It's okay. We'll get it over to him. You know, let's hope that a lot doesn't get swarmed by the... We gotta get Shanna out of here. Archer. 
Axe is looking like a dangerous one for lot, but we'll see how it goes. Hand Axe hopefully defer deters. Yeah, let's see. Okay. Goes for Marcus. Right. We... Okay, we should be okay. Oh, crit. Crit. This is right, fine. Just slows it down. Uh oh. Okay. Okay, that kind of works. That actually does work. Somehow. Lot doesn't take any hits now either because these guys went for Marcus. Yeah, you'll have to deal with one cab, I think. Ooh. Oh my god! <gasps> no! 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 What the shit? Whoa. Oh man. Set Ilya in stone. Yep, we're going to Ilya. I mean, we were anyway. <laughs> man. We don't have Ooh. Shin now. Oh god. Okay. I mean, he's gonna have to kill both of Fur and Shin next uh, chapter nine. Man, that was that was me being lazy. That was that was on me. Oof. It's okay. Don't worry about it. I just needed to move Sue over here. I could have done that too. I don't know why I thought this was a safe spot. Oh my god. Right. And what's worse is that if I healed her, she would have lived. Ah, oh, I'm so dumb. But you know what I'm glad about? I traded the hero quest. <laughs> yeah. If the hero quest had gone, then that would have been the biggest tragedy. Yeah. Oh my god, dude. Let's get Lou here. Man. I really this this chapter is absolutely savage. <sighs> yeah, this is what I was telling you. I didn't know why you were excited for Deke. How does Deke do against the soldiers though? Twenty three minus six. That's a lot of damage he might have to take. So I'm thinking, yeah, let's do this. Uh, Lots on the revenge. Lot, well, yeah. Thank you, Kelda. I don't think Lot would be like that. Too, yeah. Yeah, let's see. Yeah, Marcus here. Lot, Marcus on the yes. revenge. <laughs> Man, dude, that was the worst. That one hurt the most. That really hurt. Shin is so useful. Mm. Possible, but I mean, what's your life looking like? What I like about putting Jero here and attacking is we could trade the halberd to Lot. In... Where's the halberd? Deke has it. Okay. Deke has it. Really, trick? Buddy. <sighs> my god, dude. I kind of want to go for this. Yeah. I think I'd say it's worth. Oof. Right. Okay, good. Man. The Sue death was so preventable. Lot actually doesn't even need the halberd to do this. Nah. Let's go for it. That's what I mean about it skipping a note. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I get that. This is terrifying. This map is... Uh, my opinion of this map has changed so much. <laughs> Evidently. I'm glad. No, Deke will die, so... Nice, that's clean. I never thought soldiers could be so threatening. Oh, oh no. I should have just enemy phased that one. What's the deep looking like? Let's see. This Jero's like Jero. definitely dead. So I'm thinking. 
Dude, Trek won't get doubled if you... Yeah, yeah, let's do this. Watch this strat. That's pretty epic. Let's just double check the hit points here. They're fine. Um, I might do this just to, like, save Marcus. Potentially. Marcus. Yeah, yeah, fair. I mean, what can... Oh, yeah, it's okay. Never mind. Man, I'm really bummed about Sue. I'm bummed about that hit, too. Oh, a lot. Oh. This is definitely going to be a halberd moment. If Trek got doubled by the soldier. Dude, we lost so many units this chapter. <laughs> I'm delirious. Oh, Deke. I hate 1-2 range weapons. Dude, like... <laughs> this chapter would be so much faster if Ias didn't put so many gosh darn javelins. It's just ridiculous. Do the thing. Oh, you're joking. It's not happening. Alright, we're gonna have to do some fancy moves here. Oh, come on, Alain. What's worse is that if Lot misses, yes. Lot can't get a heal, but we can block at least. Yeah, you can just throw Jero out there, trade him with a javelin. Oh, no, you He's can't. He's thinking Lou, maybe. No one can double that cab, though. Yeah, I think Lou. Well, let's get rid of the soldier first, I think. Trek, Javelin. Oh, uh, Marcus. Yeah. Yeah. Then live on two, and then Lance can come and patch up. Yeah. Honestly, this chapter, who thought it was a good idea? <laughs> I want to know. I got to know. Yeah. Ugh. Man. Dude, Sue and Shin. Our Sake dreams shattered. Yeah, that's okay. What Not is bad time. though here is that Lot is kind of fucked. Actually, no, we have Shanna still. So. Let me get just patch up the hole with Trek or something. Sweet. Lot needs Shana to land this. No. Root girl will have to rescue Lou so that Shanna can pick him up. I think the play- oh, elixir, elixir, enemy face, halberd. I left it on iron. I'm just doing iron axe just in case. Because, like, he could go on a tear and still die. So, I want to yeah, be true. cognizant of that. Yeah. Okay. Alright. And then, let me just check something real quick. Steel lance. Javelin. Silver Lance. Okay. How, can you take a Javelin? Yes, you can. 16. All right, yes. Cool. Okay. We're fine. All these guys can take a Javelin. All right. We're fine. How target <laughs> intended. Just, just rush for the boss. Rush for the boss. Yeah. What? Come on, bud. Yeah. Just get deep with the armor slayer to just run for the boss. Yep, I agree. Oh, yeah, I gotta get ready get for work too. Yeah. Alright. Uh, not so amazing. Let's try the halberd. Oh, it's gotta be by this point. Dodge oh. it. Nope. No! Oh, when we need it most. Okay. I'm fine with this. Okay. And then Roy. Let's 
Has one of them got the arm slot? Um. Who's got it? Marcus has it. Rescue Lou. Yeah. Trek, and then have the Len take it. Trek. Trekking across the map. Okay. Okay, this could could work. Dodge it. Oh my God, Marcus. Oh. Marcus might die. Marcus might die. I won't die to a javelin, surely. Surely he's not that flimsy. Oh, the javelin guy's not in his range because this guy's blocking. Sweet. Praise Kaga AI, man. Hell yeah, bro. Right. All right, now, Lou. Yes. Okay, cool. Finally, dead. The second one's <gasps> gone. Oh my god. That's just wrong. This has been that so brutal. Power. Just do it. Just Lot. Kill him. That crunch is so satisfying. All right, Lot should be fine now. Marcus needs to... Marcus is going to get out of there. I don't even want to use the elixir because we might need it. Yeah, okay. How do you do? Not even worth it. Not even trying. worth it. <laughs> Alright. And we want to get Trek to trade the Dharma Slayer to Jero. This is where it all hangs in the balance. Oh no! Vulnerary? Somewhere? Anywhere? Please? Some? You've got to be kidding me. Alright, Shanna has one still. <laughs> this is insane! This is the most like scraping the bottom of the barrel shit I've ever had to do. <laughs> this in is amazing. This Take is fun. Vulnerary. Enemy phase, run up to the boss. It's all we can do, really. That's... Yeah, that is all we can do. The size of our... <laughs> no, he didn't. <laughs> Barely. <laughs> I don't like that Jero faces crit. That could have been really bad. Does he not top? Thank God for that. I was gonna say, doesn't he double? Yeah, four percent is nasty. That guy's a spear, which is really mean. We might be able to wrap it up, depending on where Roy is. I don't think Roy's in the right position. Nope. All right, we're gonna need to do some fancy driving here. So I think. Lou up here. Yeah, just make sure no one lines the wall so they can just get pelted with a javelin. There's just no way of healing, so just I'd say just move a lot as far back as possible. Well, I want him to choke just in case things go wrong. Okay, we'll move him. Yeah, he can choke there. Trade off the elixir just to be safe. <laughs> You're not saying Lot could possibly die. We can leave Shanna here as emergency. <laughs> what troubles me here is that we're relying on a really shaky hit rate. Well, by this point, what other choice have we got? Shara is just gonna have to vulnerary and just enemy fate. Who has the who has the elixir? You do. All right. Oh my god, dude. It's down to this. Trek Loki MVP of this map. Uh, yeah, Trek if you say so. <laughs> Trek Loki not dying. Ah, yes. 
The time has come. Let's end this. Finally. These people are powerful. Dude, you killed like all of my army and most of the future recruits I could get. Oh my god. Your army is truly terrifying. Lot though. Lot though? Doubling? <laughs> Look at him! He's a menace! Above all else, we still have lot doubling. Yeah. If there's any constant in this universe, it's lot doubling. Alright. Kills. We we need we're gonna need this experience. Cause Lou experience. Lou can promote, which is really nice. Worth a, worth a try with the halberd. Two tries here, let's go for it. Let's go. Lot's sure. like I won't let you. <laughs> I'm gonna kill these. Lot's guys. getting no experience, so I think let's I think just it's time to just end this while we can. Yeah, do we support? No, 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 just end it now. Yeah. I, I can't. Alright. City's finally under control, holy shit. Roy's not even the slightest bit phased by what he's seen today. Oh god. Good lord. Man, dude, so I'm responsible for the deaths of Saul, Clarine, Noah, Sue, and effectively Fear and Shin. <laughs> and going Sakai. <laughs> the route that you wanted to go. <laughs> Finally, some fitting music. Yeah, seriously. Oh uh, my god. Look, I don't blame you. This run, it could have been me just as easily. Um, I think either of us having to play that chapter is just absolutely brutal. Yeah, I mean, to be honest, our fate was sealed from the moment that Ellen just decided to sit still at the start of the chapter, so that, obviously, I think it's fine. Yeah, dude, just that one misclick on the first turn caused so much carnage. You did what you could with, with the hand that you were dead. Um, so, yeah, I think... <laughs> That's fair. Oh, God. Austin Revolt. One, that was one hell of a revolt. Yeah, I'm still, like, kind of... That decision to, like, save Jero versus our healers... Hopefully that won't bite us in the ass too much. Um, I think we'll Jero make use of make the most of him. Yeah, I think Jero's combat will during this like next portion of the game will make up for not having two healers. Like effectively, Ellen can do the same job as Saul and Clarine. Ellen's just gonna take longer to get to warp, and she doesn't have as much utility. But her core function of healing is still intact. Jero's combat, he's probably like one of our best combat units still. Like definitely like. Top five. So, like, I'm willing to make that that trade. I don't know if it's the right trade or the ideal trade. Um, well, it's, the, it's the trade it's we had to make, you know. Um, I think... Hang on a minute. If, if I'm not mistaken... Um, hang on. Oh, okay, no, I was just... No, I was just going to say, I was wondering if you needed uh, Jero to recruit Juno, but I think you can do it with the pegs. But it's safer bringing... Jero than it is the Pegasus Knights. So. Yeah. Oh, God. Well, we did it. We well, did it. Yeah, I think that should be the title of this video. Well, we did it. Yeah, uh, somehow. God. Well, yeah. I'm ready to go and just uh, <laughs> breathe. Until I know. I have to go work a full day now, which I'm stoked about. So, anyway, <sighs> guys, this has been well, an hour and 54 minutes of Fire Emblem 6. The Binding Blade, Intelligent Systems, Fix Your ROM Hack. Not that you don't please. need that many. Not javelins are annoying. Oh, yeah, please. God. Too many javelins. Um, Wyvern's too strong. Nerf them, please. Yeah. Um, take away their sound effect when they dodge. You know, just do whatever you need to do for the next hack. You know. Yep. Anyway, until next time, guys. Reunion. See, you later. See ya.